Mombasa. Mombasa Gen Z demonstrators who had taken a break today returned to the street with a bang, demanding full implementation of the demands by President William Ruto. The Gen Z have expressed no confidence with the government while demanding the removal from office of the Chief Cabinet Secretary Musale Mudavadi, whose office is unconstitutional. Kitu cha kwanza Mudavadi lazima aende nyumbani. 60 years and above mtu yetu kwa ofisi ya government afai kuweko. The peaceful demonstrators have condemned the killing of their colleagues while calling on the government to conduct thorough investigations concerning the Kwarem Kurukwenjenga killings. The killings that are going on in the country cannot be supported. The killings in the country are unjust. They are contravening the human rights of the citizens of Kenya. Extrajudicial killings which are happening in Kwara in Nairobi. We can say that is something which has been stage managed. It's not something which you can trust. Live bullets. Live bullets. Imagine. Wale wenzetu ambao wameuliwa tunataka haki, watendeo haki, wasipotendeo haki, tutendelea kwa andamana mpaka kieleweke. The increase of road maintenance levy in fuel by 7 shillings from 18 to 25 shillings, which was highly opposed by Kenyans, took a center stage as suits opposed the move by EPRA while expressing fears that the president might even decide to reinstate all his cabinet secretaries. Bado hata atujui the next CSS watayekwa, how competent they will be. Is, is he going to put technocrats in the in the cabinets or not. We don't need a dialogue to post in time doctors. We don't need a dialogue to restore school feeding programs. We don't need a dialogue to restore Linda Mama. However, Mr. President, Acha Kuganganya. No, let me tell you the leader of Gen Z. The love of Gen Z is William Sabu Ruto. No one else. This is the only setting up. Upon reaching Saba Saba, the demonstrations turned violent after police threw tear gas to protesters who have vowed to continue with their demonstrations, also targeting the county government of Mombasa, accusing it of nepotism and misuse of public resources. The message should reach out to Abdul Swamad. We are going to occupy even the county's government because the Mepata embezzlement of funds is being done at the county government. Misappropriation of funds is being done at the county government. Nepotism at the county government. We want you to account for all funds. In including the bursaries that you gave, who are the beneficiaries and how much was the budget for the, uh, for the, for the bursaries. We have a lot of incompetent professionals in your offices. We have a lot of ghost workers in Mombasa County. We want you to account on that. So Sharif uh, Abdul Nasir, we are coming for you. Bonfas, Msangi K24, Mombasa.